All right, so today is, I'm gonna check the date. I'm probably not gonna post this on YouTube, but um, I don't know, whatever, I might, but probably not. So today is um, Monday, September 18th, and it is 1.56 uh, p.m. in the afternoon. Um, I'm about to do the Starbucks challenge. It, it's a challenge that has like many different names, but like the specific version that I heard was called the Starbucks challenge, I'm pretty sure. I, I heard about it in the book a while ago. Anyway, this challenge consists of going into a crowded area, whether that be like a public park or a shopping mall or anything like that, and then just lying on the ground for um, 30 seconds. I heard the time, the times can vary from like 15 seconds to 30 seconds, but like I'm gonna do this for, for, uh, for uh, I'm gonna do this for 30 seconds. I'm wearing a hood right now, despite the warm weather, because um, a floor is not clean, and like I don't want my hair on the like making direct contact with the floor. So I have my hair like in, I have my hair in the back of the hood. Um, I honestly probably look like a criminal right now, just going off of how I'm dressed. But um, this shouldn't be a long thing, so I'm just gonna go lie on the ground really quick. I'm gonna try and record it. The whole point of the challenge is to like um, kind of like help you push your comfort zone, and then. It should like allow you to do like other things in, in other areas of your life because like you're pushing your comfort zone in this one area because when you go and lie on the ground people are going to look at you and people are going to judge and you're going to feel the judgment and they're honestly probably going to think that you're crazy um and they're going to stare so yeah like you it's really going to like push my comfort zone because like i don't know like just thinking about doing this is like terrifying me like now that i talked about it on camera it kind of like eased the tension um I know like when I show people this video, they're gonna still think I'm insane and people are not gonna understand like why I'd wanna do something like this. Like I don't wanna do something like this, but um, I'm all for like self-development and pushing your comfort zone and like all that kind of stuff. So that is why I'm doing this. So this is this is before, this is before I've actually done it. Um, uh, I've gotta describe how I'm feeling right now. So I'm very nervous. I'm insanely nervous right now. I have never done anything like this before. Uh, I love pushing my comfort zone, but I've never done something this crazy. I'm really hoping that the security doesn't like think I'm on drugs or something because like I am 100% sober right now the only thing I've consumed today is like a chickpea bean salad or whatever but yeah so I just wanted to film this quick before um I don't know how this is gonna work in practice but what I would like to do is like go I'm gonna sit down on the floor first I'm probably gonna go to the food court I'm gonna sit down on the floor and I'm gonna take out my timer I'm gonna set it for 30 seconds and I'm gonna just lie back and I'm gonna record myself and I'm gonna maybe I'll talk about how I'm feeling as I'm lying there and then, then afterwards, I'll just get up and like leave. Um, I'm gonna go do it in, in a mall that I don't go to often because I'm not trying to go back and then security's like, oh yeah, uh, you're the guy who's on the ground, like we're gonna get you or something. Cause like, I don't understand like how this could really be like illegal or anything because like all I'm doing is like lying on the ground. Like I'm not, I'm not gonna go lie in front of anybody. I'm gonna like go in an area where there's a lot of people but where I'm not obstructing anybody's path. Cause I don't wanna bother anybody. I literally just wanna push my comfort zone. So anyway, um, that's all I wanted to say, and uh, yeah. All right, so I'm now here in the mall. I have the timer for the 30 seconds to find a place to lie down now. All right, so I'm in the bathroom about to attempt this challenge. It should be pretty interesting. Very, very nervous. I found, I found a pretty like cool spot to do it, so I have my brightness all the way up, so I hope the timer shows. <coughs> So here is attempt number one. Oh. Here is the timer. So I'm now on the ground. It's now been 10 seconds. It's actually not that bad. So afterwards, it's actually not that bad at all. Like, I don't know, not even scary. So, yeah. Yeah, so I, I just did the first one. The mall wasn't too busy, but um, there were still like people there. And so I just walked and I just lied on the ground and then 
Um, I sat down first, I set the timer, then I lied back. And then, like, nobody, one, I, I think I heard a lady make, make a comment, she's like, oh, that doesn't look comfortable. But, like, the second I had sat down, it wasn't even scary anymore. So, like, what I, so, like, it is true what they say, like, what I've taken from this is, like, it's only scary if you allow it to be. Because, like, the second I was actually lying down, then, like, it, it was, like, normal, as weird as that sounds. It was just, like, I guess everybody lies on the ground. Like, um... I don't know, that was not even that bad. I'm now at Walmart. This is definitely gonna be busier than the mall. I didn't mention this at the beginning, but like, there's like 80 bucks on the line here. Because I knew that if I didn't, like, um, if I wouldn't lose out by not doing this, then I would, um, what do you call it? Then I'd probably end up, like, getting scared and, like, not doing it. So, I think it was four people that I, that I, I told, I told four different people that I would give them $20 if I didn't do it. So $80 was on the line. I was gonna push it up to 100 by adding in a fifth person, but then I, I opted out. But, um... Yeah, so, so I would have lost 80 bucks. So the, the thing is, I have to go and do one more. Um, the, 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 the deal was I have to go to two different crowded places and lie on the ground for 30 seconds in order to not have to pay 80 bucks. So I'm going to do this Walmart, which I'm, I'm, as much as I just did it and it wasn't even that bad, I'm still getting back in my head again and I'm still getting scared. But I'm going to go do it here. And uh, yeah, after that, there's a, like a little Wendy's over there. Uh, it looked pretty busy, so I'm gonna go do that. The only thing I'm, like, I'm just not down for is like I'm not trying to like have other people taking videos and like I like ending up in the paper or, or like something like that because like I'm just doing this purely for social growth. But um, I don't know. I guess that's like one of the like casualties of war. But anyway, okay, I'm I'm, I'm going into the Walmart now. So I'm leaving the Walmart. I ended up opting out of like of like trying Walmart because too many shopping carts and. The busiest part of the of the store that I could find, it was like uh like the produce area and like vegetables and all that stuff. And like uh I don't know, there's too many people walking and like it was right beside like the storage doors. And then um there's too many like managers and stuff. So like I feel like if I had tried, then like like they would have like run to save me or something or like thought like I was ill or something and like tried to help me out. So I opted out of there. I see there's another store over here. I'm gonna try this. So I opted out of Walmart um, because I went in and after, like, going in I was scared. When I was in the car I was terrified. And then when I actually got in the store I was like, ah, oh, it's not even that bad anymore. And then I was like walking around trying to find a crowded place where I could like lie down and do it. But like, I don't know, in the mall, the employees are all in their stores. So it's like, it's just mainly normal people that are just walking around. So like if an employee sees me lying on the ground, they're probably gonna go think, they're probably gonna think I'm like, I, I hurt myself or something and, and they're gonna go call a manager. And then like, I'm not trying to have to explain all this that I'm just like, like, they're, cause they're gonna think something else is up or that drugs are involved or something. So I just, I opted out of Walmart just because it didn't seem very practical. Um, I do feel kind of like defeated and bad that I didn't do it, but um, I feel like it's better to just like not have done that and like not have any issues with security or anything. So I'm now at the real Canadian Superstore. I don't know how it's gonna be in here. I've never been in one of these before, but I'm gonna go check and see. And then um, if I can't do it here, then I'm just gonna go do it at Wendy's um, and yeah. We'll have to see how this goes. All right, so I've gone and done a couple laps, and then I don't know. Like, I'm not trying to be in people's way, but um, I don't know. I can't really find like a, a crowded area where it's gonna be really nerve-wracking. I'm just gonna go do it really quick because uh, this is taking a long time. Right. Oh. So I'm now on the ground. It's not that crowded here, but whatever. I'm setting the timer. Now I'm leaning back. Definitely not as nerve wracking the second time around. But uh, it's really not that crowded here. But like, I'm still like in the middle of the store. 15 seconds in. I'm at 20 seconds now. 25. And 30 seconds. Second time around, it's definitely not that scary. It's just like trippy the first time, but like, I don't know. It's definitely not that bad. Now, now I'm going to Wendy's to try it the third time. Like this should be more nerve wracking because like it's gonna be a more crowded place. There'll be more people around. So yeah. All right, so this is attempt number three. Oh, on the ground, my head up. I'm reset for 30 seconds. It's the most crowded place so far. It's not that bad this time around. 10 seconds. 15 
in second term. People, people are staring this time, but it's not even that bad. 20 seconds. 25. Probably do this one for 45, why not? 30 seconds now. 37. So that, this one was the most nerve-wracking so far. I honestly don't know if anybody took any videos or not, but like, I don't know, that was the most nerve-wracking one so far because like, I was like close to the people who were sitting down, but I don't know, still not that bad. So, I don't know, that's three, that's the bonus one. Both places were relatively crowded. Uh, the last one was the most crowded. The second one was a grocery store, so that was kind of shitty and boring, but I don't know, I got a kick out of this one. But uh, yeah. The employees literally stopped working to stare. Uh, but yeah, that's, that's good. That's done. I don't know. I feel really accomplished now. Like I really wish I had just done it at Walmart, but whatever. I can't do it everywhere. But um, yeah. Now that I've done it alone, I'd like to try it with like friends and like see if we can all push our comfort zones. Like it definitely won't be as scary if I go with more people. But um, yeah. I feel really happy that like I did that. Like it seems so scary going into it. I was like almost losing sleep over this last night. I was so scared. But, like now that I've done it not even that bad and like i feel like now i'll be able to do other things without like much worry but yeah anyway i may or may not post this i don't know yet but um if i post this and then like uh you saw me lying on the ground like the tim hortons or the like the mall or uh the superstore then like this will be the explanation of like oh it's for social development like he wasn't just being weird uh no well i don't know i guess i would say it's, it's, it's pretty weird to lie on the ground but um i don't know i want to try this again in the future where like i lie on the ground and then uh like order something after because like that would be really scary but i don't know that was good for today you got to start small and move slow but anyway yeah if i post this thank you for watching if not then yeah